I asked uh, Wesley and Grace if, I'm going to say Tanner and Grace, if I could uh, spend a few moments talking about his mom. Um, <clears throat> if there's ever a mother that loved a son, she loved her sons. And Tanner was her boy, for sure. Um, but I just know that she's looking down with tears of joys, and she's very proud of you. And I think Grace would exceed her expectations. So, mom's here. Like from the very beginning, like I can always be myself. So I think I just remember that the feeling that I had in those first two weeks with him was what I imagined all those people talk about when they say, when you find the one that you know. So Wesley and I actually met on a dating app, but what was funny is that we were both working at Wash U Medical School at the campus, so we were just like across the way from each other, and um, we, you know, were working together for many months after that. So I like to think we would have met anyway if we hadn't met on the dating app. <laughs> And so we both kind of had a lot of anticipation before our first date because we were talking for quite a while before our first date happened. As you embark on this new journey together, always remember the importance of making time for one another. Uh, listen to your partner, never be too critical, embrace your differences and be accepting and forgiving because this is what true love's all about. And unlike me, Wes has actually always believed in Patrick Mahomes. All right? I know, I'm embarrassed to say that. But that means that Wes knows how to scout out top class people, which is how I know that Grace is a true future Hall of Famer. All right? And then we went to a concert, and kind of afterwards, uh, that was the first time that I told her that I loved her. And I think that wasn't that long after our first date. So it, it really didn't take very long. My wish for you both is that you continue the support through the journey of life. Wes, you have the best spokesperson and cheerleader that you could ever wish for. Please take care of my sister, as I know she will always do everything in her power to take care of you. When we're younger or growing into our young adulthood, when you can really envision that life with somebody, um, it's really, I think, exciting to know that you're gonna have someone who wants to share that life with you. And so you have to do a deep dive if you're gonna talk about football, right? So I came up with a statistic that matches for football and marriage. So how about this one for you guys, all right? Since 2016, since you guys have been dating, the Chiefs have won the AFC West Championship every single year, all right? How about that? so far. I think we've had a, a lot of time to you know, get to know each other and kind of learn about each other, but I know that we're going to learn you know, a lot more about each other in the rest of our lives, and I'm just looking forward to, to starting this journey.
some of the things that I love about him is he's a really, really good listener. He's really smart and caring, and those are things I just really admire in people. So let's raise a glass to the bride and groom. May your love continue to shine bright, and may you both enjoy a lifetime of happiness together. Thank you for always loving me for who I am, and I can't wait for our life together. Mm -hmm.